Good morning friends. Today we will discuss about selection operator which is one of the operator in the relation algebra. Now it is used to retrieve the tuples from the relation. Okay. If you have a relation R or some relation called student, if you want to retrieve some tuples or all the tuples, then we will use the selection operator. So that's why we even call this one as a horizontal splitting because we are splitting the table horizontally. Okay. We can split the table into vertically or horizontally. So the selection operator is splitting the relation into horizontally. So that's why we can call it as it will retrieve the tuples from the relation. It can retrieve some of the tuples or you can retrieve all the tuples in the relation. Now when we can say that it will retrieve some tuples, I will give some condition here. So this is the basic way of using the selection operator. You have a selection operator and you have a selection condition on what you can want to apply the condition. Whether it can be this R can be a relation means it can be a table or it can be a relation algebra expression meaning is that some other operator has applied on the relation R then on the result of that one you are applying the selection we can do it is it clear suppose if I want to apply the projection on a relation R after that I want to apply the selection here this one is a relation algebra expression why the projection is applied on a relation R on the output of that one we are applying a selection operator is it clear so we can directly apply the selection operator on the relation R you can apply on the relation algebra expression also now what is the selection condition we will talk about what is the condition you want to apply in SQL we will write where attribute name is equal to some condition or where attribute name is equal to some constant or where some condition operator value like that we will give some condition in SQL so similarly if I want to retrieve some of the tuples which satisfy a particular condition then I will mention the condition here then you can ask me sir if I does not mention any condition what will happen then you will retrieve all the tuples in the relation R or in the student it will retrieve all the tuples if you mention the condition then what are the tuples which satisfy the condition those will be retrieved if it does not mention the condition then it will retrieve all the tuples from the relation R okay let me discuss with a small example you have a student table okay it has few attributes like student ID student name and marks and some of the values I have filled for your explanation now you have a selection operator and what is my condition marks greater than or equal to 20 on a relation called student now what are the tuples which have marks greater than or equal to 20 this tuple and the second tuple and third tuple are satisfied the condition so what it will retrieve as an output it will retrieve as student id i hope it is visible here let me write here student id student name and marks so what is the output it will retrieve to b 23 c 30 so it will give the tuples which have satisfied the mentioned condition okay now i want to discuss one more point okay so can i erase this one so now if you see that we have domain and the cardinality okay the cardinality will speak about here the cardinality will speak about how many tuples we are retrieving okay the domain will talk about the number of attributes let me discuss again the cardinality will says that how many tuples we are retrieving and the domain says that how many attributes we are retrieving now can you tell me if a relation r is having n number of attributes or i can say that the domain of the relation is n if I apply the selection operator on the relation M, what is my degree? Is it clear? If the degree of the relation is N, okay, if I say it as domain or something, please correct me. If the degree of the relation is N, meaning is that the number of attributes in the relation is N, okay, if you apply the selection operator on the relation R, then what is the 
output degree will be degree also will be young because you will retrieve all the attributes only you will retrieve some of the tuples but all the attributes will be displayed it is not splitting vertical it is splitting horizontally is it clear now the cardinality the cardinality means if the relation have n, m number of tuples let's take it if i have m number of tuples if i apply the selection operator on the relation r then how many tuples i can retrieve i will retrieve few tuples which are less than or equal to m meaning is that if i have m number of tuples in the original relation r i may retrieve all the m tuples or i may retrieve few number of tuples from the relation m suppose if you see this example we have three tuples after applying the selection condition i have retrieved two so two is less than or equal to three if i does not apply any condition then it i can retrieve all the three tuples so what i want to say is that the degree will not change but the cardinality will be less than or equal to the original relation r okay i hope you have understood how the selection operator will work okay in the coming videos we will discuss about other operators in the relation algebra and i request everyone to go through the videos in a sequence for better understanding if you really like my teaching please give your feedback in the comment section your positive comments will motivate me further your negative comments will help me to learn or identify mistakes because everyone is not perfect in the world so maybe i am also doing some mistakes if you are want to tell or give me my suggestions you are free to give suggestions also if you really like my teaching you can give the positive comments okay and share the videos with your friends so that it will be useful for them also and subscribe to my channel for regular updates thank you so much